Lloyd, what are you doing? It feels like you're running at an incredible rate, Harry. To quit it, we're not even through Connecticut yet, and already you're annoying me. Sorry. Jeez. We're really doing it, though, aren't we, buddy? Yeah. Hey, where'd you get those? I bought them when we filled up. Well, wait, but you, we're supposed to talk about all expenditures, Lloyd. We are on a very tight budget. Hmm. This didn't come out of our travel fund. Oh. No, I, I was able to raise 25 extra bucks before we left. Where did you get 25 extra bucks? I sold some stuff to Billy and Forsey. The blind kid? <laughs> yeah. What did you sell him, Lloyd? What kind of stuff? I don't know. A few baseball cards, a sack of marbles. <coughs> Petey. Petey? You sold my dead bird to a blind kid? Lloyd, that, that you, what do you? Petey didn't even have a head. Harry, I took care of it. Pretty bird. Yeah, can you say pretty bird? Pretty bird. Yes, pretty bird. Pretty bird. Polly want a cracker? Those red bastards. They're rubbing up right in our faces. Man, Andre have a goddamn hemorrhage. We don't get that briefcase back. They must have been following us for weeks. Why you say? Gas, man. How the hell do they know that I got gas? They gotta be pros. Don't worry. We're gonna get that money back. And I'll tell you something else. They ain't never getting the Aspen. I'm gonna see to that. They got the monkeys. Mm -hmm. They were a major influence on the Beatles. Yeah, I know. Excuse me, Flo. <laughs> Flo liked the TV show. Uh, what is the soup du jour? It's the soup of the day. Mm, that sounds good. I'll have that. Anything else before I leave the area? No. Yeah, yes. Yes, my soda's flat. It doesn't have any bubbles. Happy now? Feels good to mingle with these laid-back country folk, don't it, Hare? I like it a lot. Uh-oh. What? What's the matter? You spilled the salt. That's what's the matter. Spilling the salt is very bad luck. We're driving across the country. The last thing we need is bad luck. Quick, toss some salt over your right shoulder. What the hell? Uh-uh. Too little too late, Harry. Who's the dead man that hit me with the salt shaker? Oh, that, it was a terrible mistake, sir. Please, oh, believe me, I would never do anything to offend a man of your size. Kick his ass, sea bass! Go ahead, sea bass. You gonna eat that? What, that? No, yes, no. Well, no, I, I'd crossed my mind. Yeah. Still want it? Nah, you go ahead. <laughs> you really wimped out, man. We talking about wimped out? We, what? Did you? The guy hawked at my burger. Wait a second. What? I think I just. Yeah, I just had an idea.
Follow me. Excuse me, guys. What the hell do you want? Uh, I just want to apologize for that uh, unpleasant scene a little earlier. My friend Harry and I would uh, like to buy you guys a round of beers just to bury the hatchet. Make it four Boilermakers. Whatever you want, sir. I'll have the waitress bring it over immediately. Wait, what are you doing? We can't afford to buy them drinks. Um, excuse me. Seabass and the fellows offered to pick up our check. They said just put it on their tab. They're very nice. Seabass said that. Well, if uh, that guy at the table over there is Seabass, 